think I started Art Studio now really based on my having three children of my own and I created art with them and I learned so much from them and enjoyed it so much that they're sort of the most important um, art project in my life. But uh, after I started Art Studio, I over eight years I've learned an incredible amount from my students and mentoring them has inspired my work and they, um, they're just so creative and they don't hold back and they sort of speak the truth. I just love that. So, and I love outsider art and folk art and it really fits in nicely. So a lot of times I find myself after they leave their classes, I start painting because they inspire me that much. I, this is a, a family um, piece that I started probably almost a year ago, which is really difficult. And it's a work in progress, it's not finished. This um, tray, and I have worked on trays for years, and that sort of speaks to my domestic side. Um, this is recent, and I had gone for a walk with some friends to get some exercise in South Orange, and I, we came upon eight deer. We were so outnumbered. There were four of us and eight deer, and um, I was just in awe uh, of the whole controlled environment versus you know nature. And so I started doing this, and from that, I decided to embark on a series about suburban nuisances, um, wildlife portraits, and the like. So I'm trying to break, have a break with my boxes and my trays and go forward with canvas and painting, which I love. I think it's it's really actually new. I have I this is my 20th year in Maplewood and the reason obviously I moved to the area was because of my children and suburbia sort of speaks to that to children. And so reflecting on the suburbs and people's you know battle with nature especially the the landscapers that come and blow the leaves and you know just you have to your little area has to be super contrived but yet you know the development is gone un unchecked and this is a real departure because I usually focus on current events but um, they've gotten so depressing that <laughs> I had to kind of really pull away from that and just kind of think about suburbia and how it's affected me over the last decades. Mm, I have a few close friends, one in particular that um, I spend time with and we share each other's work and the influence is moderate from outsiders really. I go into Manhattan a lot. Bye.